Hi, my name is Malcolm and I'm a PSLE Science Specialist here at The Big Lab. Welcome to another episode of PSLE Science Made Simple. In this video, I'll be going through a past year examination question on the topic of animal classification. I've also prepared this question for you to download for free by clicking a link in the description box below. So, let's get started. Question 2. They ask which of the following characteristics are found in insects, but they are not in other animals. So, let's check the first statement. Now, statement A said that insects have wings. Now, is this something that is found only in insects? No, which other group of animals also have wings? They are animals like the birds. So, we can write this down. Birds have wings too. Which means, is this a characteristic found only in insects? No, so we can cross out A. Next, what about for B? For B, they say that insects have a pair of feelers. Now, is this found only in insects? I know what some of you must be thinking. You see the word feelers and you think only insects have them, so you think B is correct. But do you know there are other animals besides insects that also have feelers? Can you think of any examples? One good example is the prawn. If you have ever seen a prawn with its head attached, I'm sure you can see that they have two feelers coming out from the top of their head. So we can write this out. Not only do insects have feelers, but prawns have feelers too. So because of that, is this a characteristic found only in insects? No, which means, can we choose B as our answer? Also, no. So let's cross it out. Next, let's take a look at C. They say that insects have three body parts. Now, is this found in any other animals? No. So because of that, can I choose C as my answer? Yes. Yeah, so let's put a tick. And lastly, what about for D? They said that insects have three pairs of legs. Now, do any other groups of animals have this? No. Is this found only in insects? Yes, which means, can I choose D as my answer? Definitely. So with this, we can get our answer already. What should be the correct answer then? The correct answer should be C and D only, which is option Thank you for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you found this video useful, do give us a thumbs up. If you'd like to check out more videos by us, do click on the links on the right hand side. Last but not least, don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more interesting videos. Thank you and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!